السلام علیکم بسم اللہ الرحمن الرحیم in the name of Allah the most beneficent and the most merciful uh, guys as you know that I'm solving the past paper of AP Calculus 2018 and I already solved from question number 1 to question number 16 now we are going to solve question number 17 uh, question number 17 is just a problem solving questions okay I will try my best to explain this question so whenever you have any problem problem solving question you have to just choose the keyword right once you understand the concept of the keywords then you can solve the question easily okay so now the question is spherical here there is a spherical mean there is a sphere so you can say this is a spherical a snowball right means you understand that the 3d shape a sphere is given right okay is melting in such a way that it's maintained its shape means we can say there is a sphere it's melting right so the snowball is decreasing, decreasing means minus, decreasing means something is decreasing, it means we can say the slope is a negative, right? So the snowball is decreasing in a volume at a constant rate, constant rate, rate means time, means you can say the slope, the derivative of, you can say the derivative is decreasing, okay, with the time, okay, and the, the numerical value is given, 8 cubic centimeter per hour means you can say in one hour it's decreasing uh, 8 centimeter cube right this is decreasing means we can say cubic per hour means we can the dv by dt right here the hour is means the time is hour and the quantity is what the value okay so at what rate in centimeter per hour is the radius of the snowball is decreasing at the instant at that instant when the radius is 10 centimeter here they are saying that for example what will be means at what rate in centimeter per hour means we have to find what dr by dt this means we are asking about dr by dt when the radius is what 10 centimeter so very simple i am going to solve this question here answer right so what do you have to do here just write down the volume of the sphere which is given here right so v v is equal to 4 by 3 pi r cube as you know we have here volume and here is what radius this is the volume of the sphere right okay so we are going to find what here it is mentioned that the uh, is decreasing in a volume at a constant rate 8 cubic centimeter means 8 centimeter cube per hour you can say so we can say this is what centimeter cube this is the unit of the value and here this is what radius here i am going to introduce one uh, uh, one quantity you can say that is time okay so i am going to find i am not going to find dv by dr okay i am going to find dv by dt okay so when you solve dv by dt means differentiate this one with respect to t so dv by dt it can be written as d by dt 4 by 3 pi r cube right so 4 by 3 pi is out and d by dt r cube right so when you solve this question you will find 4 by 3 pi and this is r cube okay this is not t we are going to differentiate r with respect to t so first i will apply the chain rule so r cube will be what 3 r square and here i will write dr by dt and here in the question they are asking that at uh, what rate in centimeter per hour so this is what centimeter this is per hour it means we have to find dr by dt okay when r is 10 centimeter right so here and one more thing here it is dv, dv by dt dv by dt and this value is given dv by dt how much uh, it's decreasing 8 so I, i'm going to write down minus why because minus means it's decreasing so minus 8 4 by 3 pi and what is the value of r at the time 10 10 square and we have to find dr by dt so here you can say this is uh, 4 multiplied by 1 4 4 multiplied by 2 8 so you can say minus 2 pi over 3 and 10 square is 100 right so this is what dr by dt so here you can say minus 2 is equal to 100 pi divided by 3 dr by dt so if you cross if you make a cross multiplication you will find minus 6 divided by 100 pi dr by dt okay again we can just check here 4 by 3 pi r is 10 10 10 100 okay 
and uh, 4 multiplied by 1, 4, 4 multiplied by 2, minus 2, and this is what, 5 by 3, 10, 10, 100, right, dr by dt, so 100 pi, here 3, here what, uh, so this is minus 6, and, uh, six. okay, we will see here, doing some mistake here, dv by, dv by dt is how much, minus 8, right, so this is minus 8, 4 by 3 pi, r is, Ah, sorry, 4 by 3 pi, this is uh, 3, right? Because this is 3 r square, so this is 3. So we can see here, it is also 3 here. So 3 will be where? Here. So this is 3 r square. It will be 3 multiplied by 3. Or you can say 3, 3 cancel, right? So it's very simple here. Just cancel this part. You can just multiply here. right so you can say 3 3 cancel so this is minus 2 divided by uh, 100 pi and this is what dr by dt 2 multiplied by 1 2 and this is 50 so we can say dr by dt is equal to minus means decreasing because here the question is at uh, the question was at what rate in centimeter per hour is the radius of the snowball decreasing so minus will tell us just here we are getting dr by dt in negative so i'm going to neglect this one because it will tell us the negative so answer is 1 over 50 55 right so dr by dt is equal to 1 divided by 55 which is a so we can say answer a is correct right i hope guys you all understand please watch my next video because where we are going to solve question number 18 thank you bye bye assalamu alaikum